What's up guys, today's video is on the Under Armour Charge to Cert 9 Reviews 2023. The midsole is composed of UAS proprietary charge cushions for an incredibly responsive ride. This cushioning is composed of compression molded foam that really contours to the shape of your foot as you run. It's just one of those shoes that just gets better the more that you wear them. It may feel a little blocky on those first initial runs, but after a few miles the compression foam molds to the unique shape of your foot for a ride that feels as if it was customized for the unique shape of your feet. The charge cushioning also helps to cut down on the impact when running on hard and unforgiving surfaces. When you press down into this shoe, you can see the plush midsole collapse under the weight of your body. Not only does this midsole provide a nice and cushioned ride, but it also reduces the strain on your knees and joints while running. If the charged midsole wasn't enough cushion, this daily trainer also includes an EVA sock liner for an extra jolt of cushioning. The sock liner is nice and breathable and can be removed as needed. Outsole the solid rubber outsole is incredibly durable and offers a nice and springy ride. This outsole offers a textured grip that sticks to the sidewalk, but might be a little less than ideal when running in grass or trails. Some runners found that the groove design in the heel can cause the heel to slip when running in grass or uneven surfaces on trail. Overall, I would suggest sticking to surfaces such as concrete or asphalt or a rubber gym floor. By crafting this outsole with a full rubber design with no exposed EVA foam, it can ride a little stiff. The thick rubber is incredibly bouncy and responsive and will add an extra spring to your step. However, some runners found that the full rubber outsole is a little stiff and makes this shoe a bit too heavy for long distance running. What you gain in durability and responsiveness you lose in endurance and agility. Upper The upper in this design is packed with high-end cushion that wraps your feet in 360 degrees of comfort. It boasts a thick padded collar that really hugs your ankle and boosts overall lockdown. At first, some runners found that this thick and padded heel collar rubbed blisters into their fit. While the break-in period can be a little uncomfortable, a good pair of socks can help make the process a little bit easier until the foam padding starts to break in. What I also love about the design of this upper is that it is composed of a blend of mesh and synthetic overlays to boost breathability and stability. The mesh panels help to move hot air up and away from your feet, while the strategically placed leather overlays boost stability and lock these shoes firmly in place on your feet. The build of the upper is thicker than your average daily trainer and can run a bit hot when training in warmer climates. If you can forgive a bit of heat in exchange for plush padding, this is a super comfortable ride that is worth checking out. Performance Overall, I would recommend the UA Charge Dessert 9 for those that have a very versatile training schedule. While it's great for nice and easy tempo runs, it also performs quite well in the gym. If you like to engage in cycling, CrossFit, HIIT, weight training, or circuits, this is an insanely versatile shoe that can keep up. The high-end midsole cushion and responsive midsole is ideal for a wide variety of workouts while protecting your joints and providing a good deal of stability. If you like to dabble in more than just running, this shoe is a great choice. While it excels in just about anything, it falls a little short when it comes to running long distances. The stiff and heavy rubber is quite heavy and may weigh you down a bit when tackling over 5 miles. Fit Overall, the UAC Hard to Cert 9 runs true to size. If you are a size 9 in other Under Armour shoes, the same can be said for the Charge to Cert 9. It boasts a nice and roomy toe box that provides plenty of room for a natural toe splay to help with stability. Under Armour typically runs a little wide, which makes it perfect for a variety of feet. While it's not offered in wide sizing options, under Armour recommends sizing a half size larger than your normal size to accommodate a wide foot. If you have never tried UA shoes before, I recommend taking ample measurements of your feet and comparing those numbers to UAS sizing chart. I typically recommend runners head down to their local shoe store to give them a test spin before making a purchase, but that may not be necessary with this shoe. I combed through quite a few online reviews, and everyone that I encountered was quite pleased with the overall fit of this shoe. Style The UA Charge Dessert 9 has undergone a bit of a makeover when compared to the previous iteration in the Charge Dessert lineup. It's important to note that the changes made to the design do not affect the overall performance in the slightest. The upper is composed of a blend of mesh and synthetic overlays that look simple and sharp while locking your feet in place. The ample padding in the heel and tongue makes this shoe a little on the bulky side, but it is far more sleek and modern when compared to previous versions. I love that it is offered in a few staple color options that aren't overly flashy. Color options include back, white, and gray, as well as deep red. It's not the flashiest shoe out there on the market, but users really seem to be drawn to its minimalist style that goes with just about anything in your workout wardrobe. Price. What I love most about this training shoe from Under Armour is that it comes in at an incredibly affordable price point. 
In fact, this is one of the most affordable versatile running shoes out there on the market. While it does have its limitations, it's a great option for runners that like to constantly switch up their workouts and need something that can keep up. It's plush, supportive, insanely comfortable, and keeps the price tag well under the $100 mark. Comparisons to previous versions Under Armour struck gold with the UA charged asset lineup, and they know it. Overall, there have been very few changes made to the performance of the UA charged asset 8 and the UA charged asset 9. They both boast the same style and build quality of the outsole, and the performance of the charged midsole is almost identical. The only change made in the overall construction of this shoe is the build of the upper. Performance wise, the upper is just as breathable and cushioned as previous versions. UA tinkered around a bit with the placement of the synthetic overlays which makes the such just a tad more flexible. The cut of the upper is more streamlined and just looks better. Previous versions of this shoe were a little blocky, and this updated upper makes this shoe look more modern and sleek. Overall, the UA Charge Desert 9 performs just as well as previous versions, but it has undergone a makeover to look more modern and sleek and less clumsy and blocky. Pros The plush charged midsole is responsive yet durable. Full-length rubber outsole. Very cushioned heel counter and tongue. Breathable yet supportive mesh and leather upper. Works well for a wide variety of workouts. Comes in at a very affordable price point. Cons Not ideal for long distances. Long break in period. Verdict If your training schedule includes more than running, the UA Charge Desert 9 is a great choice. Runners love that this shoe is insanely versatile and can keep up with most training schedules. Whether you are running at the track or engaging in cross-training or speedy sets at the gym, this shoe is a great choice. It boasts an insanely responsive and highly cushioned charged midsole that reduces the impact when running on hard surfaces or simply when you need to stand on your feet all day. The full-length rubber outsole boosts this shoe's durability and helps add an extra spring to your step. With a highly cushioned upper, this shoe walks that fine line between stability and performance and wraps your feet in 360 degrees of plush cushioning. The best part, it is one of the most affordable daily trainers out there on the market that is just as durable and supportive as many of the more expensive designs. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button, and if you have something to say, please leave a comment.